Crazy, ooh, you deep. Oh, I gave you one. I left a, I left my own freaking apartment and well, I guess that ain't for love. I guess that's for ex-love, because I was leaving. Well, I got out of love. <laughs> Craziest thing I've done for love. Put a car on somebody in my name for somebody, I guess. Oh, that, that was that's insane. That was insane. That was insane. Mm -hmm. So gave somebody my apartment? That's a, that's one. Sure. So you you wait so much of the playhead you present yourself to be. But I was more really young. a lover boy of love. When I was young. Oh, that was before you were traumatized. Yeah, okay. man. Okay. I, yeah. Okay. I don't know. Forget these hoes, man. Uh, do you want a girlfriend? Do I want a girlfriend? I want like four. Like. Right when I thought we were being serious. I'm serious. That's what. Yeah. Can you afford four girlfriends mentally? I can afford two. I said mentally. When are you talking about? Oh, right mentally, now? heck no. <laughs> mentally, I can only afford one. <laughs> I can only afford a half mentally. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Three quarters, two quarters. Because fuck your money. The money doesn't mean anything bad. Okay. Mentally, mentally, you know, mentally I can. Can you, <laughs> can you mentally handle one. four periods? I can barely handle. Oh no, two. Nah, not even two. For real, it's. Only in the bedroom. Mentally, I can only deal with one. It's hard dealing with one mentally. My husband be like, you're about to come on. You need to leave me alone. I don't you're understand. About to come I mean, on. I guess I understand, but come on. Y'all are tripping. You For think? Real. I feel like y'all make our lives harder than what they got to be. You think? You don't think it makes it easier in that way? In some ways, yeah. Cooking, you know, taking care of the house, all that. That is great. I love that. Y'all got that down. Like, cooking, I can't cook. Okay, so at you all. do need a girlfriend at this point. Yeah, got somebody asshole. got to cook, and I need the tacos. Like, <laughs> like that's the only thing I really require. Like, you can get away with murder, but if you cook tacos, I am the guy. Okay, yes, you are right. I'm not hard to please. <laughs> like, just be quiet. Let me play the game. Why do you keep saying be quiet? That's like really a trigger for me. Like, what the fuck do you mean? I mean be quiet. Because I'm, I'm like loud. Just when I say be quiet, I mean like. I don't want a girl that's drama filled all the oh, time. Oh, you just want like a dainty lady like? Oh, you ain't gotta be dainty. I don't know what that means. What's uh, dainty? Um, super girly? Yeah, don't be, mmm. I kind of like, like that. Almost though. like meek and weird. I kind of like that though. Because I don't want you to be super boyish either. Like, I don't want to feel like I gotta, I don't know. Y'all don't feel like you got a friend now? Yeah, yeah, I want a friend. Like, a little bit, but you still need to. Yeah, yeah, that'd be nice. But I still need you to be a girl too. Yeah. I still need you to be more girlier than boys. So you want like my play Call of Duty and listen to music soul chat at the same time. Yeah, or... <laughs> <laughs> That's really like, what I do. I want you to play Call of Duty like butt naked though. Like you know what I'm saying? Like with your edge controlling your head. And a bonnet on? With a bonnet on, yes. People don't realize how sexy them are. <laughs> Men, we like weird stuff like that. The girls be thinking they ugly, like, listen here. I need you to go put on Mitch Max socks. No. Yes, that is so I'm sexy. Out. Give me, ooh, like you could come to bed butt naked with like some Mitch Max fuzzy socks and a bonnet. What? So you all right, bitch? You yes, all right, bitch. you was all right with me. Guess what? I'm never. That's not okay. Even yeah. though now that I wear wigs more than anything, I just wear my lace strap when I remember to put it on. Yeah, so and then y'all be putting makeup on to try to make it blend. Yeah. Sometimes they don't be blended. Yeah. I went skating the other day and a girl, old lace front, came off on the floor because she fell. Did she like cry? She stood down there for like five minutes. <laughs> I swear to God, I woke up. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I was right there blocking. I said, she's bald head. <laughs> she, she did wrong for putting that on her head. Number Guess one. Guess what, y'all? Like, I'm not even joking with y'all right now. When I tell y'all, I would literally die. Like, I would just sit there and just cry. I would be like, somebody please call John. I'm like, I'm a dad. Like, why do y'all think we like lace fronts stuff? Like, so why? So why? So how many, that's before you ask, how many lace fronts have you paid for? Zero. Uh, well, well I don't you? know. Well, I, people ask for money. I don't know what they do. Oh, uh, yeah, would be like, what you need it for? They, they make up stuff. Man, somebody asked me for $200 today. Because they going out of town to Miami. Uh, I'm like, you're going out of town. I'm not going to give you spending money to my You're talking about a souvenir. Right. Like, what? Pe people bold. They don't have that. That's that is what? 
I don't care if you set these bumps backwards. I don't want to give you $200 today. So what? Like, no. He said set them backwards. And I instantly get a visual. That's not a painful. That's what really happened. I ain't <laughs> never had that happen to me. Secret. I'm trying to see what that be like. You, hey, what happened? You said, How would you describe yourself in three words? Mmm, that's a good one. Let's see. How would I describe myself in three words? <laughs> um, creative. Okay. Um, I would say creative. Oh, that's tough. That's a lot of words out there. Creative. Oof. Um, Kind-hearted, sarcastic. Okay. I can at least believe two out of three. Okay. How would you describe me in three words? Bougie. Wow. Fancy. Wow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> let's see. Hmm. And is bougie and fancy two different words? Bougie, okay. fancy. I would say that's like the same really thing, describe. right? Young, I guess. Young? Yeah. You do realize when you're over 40, right? Yeah, but nah. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't think so. Yeah. When I think 40, maybe that means I'm a little bit mature. Like, when I think 40, I think people, my mom, and my mom was like, damn, you're 60. Yeah. <laughs> so, when I hear 40, I'm thinking up there, but I'm almost up there with y'all. Nah, I'm almost 40. And Ooh, that got to me. I am not bougie, but a lot of people think that about me. Depending on when you meet me, but I be outside. It's the snow boots. You think? That's a bougie thing. You think? Them Uggs. Because those be like 300, 200 and stuff. And I only got Uggs on sale. Oh, uh, see. You I think this, this was like 220 or something. But I'm going to send them back. And they still come. Oh. But I'm still going to send them back. Oh, but if we spent 300 on some Jordans, then we be in there responsible and stuff. But y'all can fend stuff on just that, though. Uh -huh. um, and it just... My hair would be six, seven hundred dollars. So yeah, see, no, hair, when, I don't know what it is about your hair, boy. That's something. Um, I, I don't think, I think you're being immature when you don't, when you do anything excessively. Everything's in moderation. Like if you buy two pair of shoes or mm -hmm. if you resell them, like, oh, I don't tell people what to look like. Yeah, yeah. Like how irresponsible they can be because you can right. see this and think that I'm being irresponsible. I used to be kind of, kind of not, I wouldn't say irresponsible, but I ain't had nothing to do with my money with, like I do now. So, like, I used to go to the strip club and blow a check. Really? With no problem. You really like this stripper, son? Yeah. That's I it. think I had a stripper addiction. <laughs> like my strange addiction. Like, I would go, yeah, like, for real, just yeah. go in the club, throw all your money, and walk out. It's Was crazy. it like, um, like a flexing thing for you? Just Probably. Like yeah. yeah. That's what that sounded like to me. It wasn't so much about the homies, because fuck them. Basically, more like, but I am a man, bitch. Yep, that's, <laughs> what, that's what it was like. Yep, yeah, like, okay. I, I, like, yeah. When your birthday? Like, I want to just slap somebody with somebody. When your birthday? February 9th. Yeah, Aquarius. Oh, Aquarius. Oh, you guys are strange creatures. What that mean? What I say? Strange to the motherfucker, too. Yeah, I don't be knowing about all them science stuff. Man, they be, some of that stuff, man, that be all over the place. They be like, well, if you're Virgo, you're nice. If you're this, no, I'm like, I don't know. Really though. Or is that just people? I would feel like some of them is just. Fluff. Yeah. And then some of us like really good depictions. What's a depiction? Like. Not a picture? No, oh. like. <laughs> my my zodiac says that I'm uh, super loyal and I'm also super stubborn. And I really am. Yeah, I'm stubborn too. Yeah, I really am. Once I don't give a fuck, I, I can't. Yeah, that's me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really, it ain't nothing you can do. Yeah. I was telling somebody the other day, once you corny, you can't be uncorned. Mm. And that's how I feel about a lot of things. Like, once I'm over you. Dang. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. And that's what, like, friend, job. I told you I just went across the street. Yeah. I yeah. literally walked across the street. It was like, you guys miss me? Can I have my old job back? Dang. <laughs> across the street. I never, I lied. I did go back to an old job, Amazon and Warehouse. That was when I was young, young. I went to that two years ago. Ooh, I ain't did the Amazon shit. CBL driving now. You know what I'm saying? 
photographer, podcaster, skater, you know, porn star on the side, you know what I'm saying? Just, just on the side, I was driving the ass <laughs> Yep, just depending on when I want to be frisky. Sorry. Mm -hmm. I get permission. Thank it's you. a real thing, but I'm verified on PH though, so you get paid. You know that? What? You get paid for being on Pornhub. Really? Really, really. How many times have you been up there? It's not important. <laughs> it's not, you, 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 I've been paid. <laughs> have you? Yep. Would you rather they be? They get paid every first of the week. They process a payment once a month. Mm -hmm. First week in each month. Would you rather be crazy rich or deeply in love? Crazy rich. Why? Because we can buy the love that you need to get you, you through. You cannot buy love. You can't buy love, but you can buy happiness. You can buy like for sure. Yeah, yeah I'll buy a be. <laughs> yeah, crazy, crazy rich for two hundred. Alex, love, I love you, but we live outside. And that's how that be though. That's ain't that much love in the world. Mm -hmm. I don't think nah. I can love me by myself. What's up, Jamie? Hey. <laughs> She's short. I'm trying to get her son to come play with me, but she sucks. Are you more into looks or brains? Hey, I mean you. What you, you can, can only pick one or the other. That could be. I'm key. going looks because if I can't look at you, I don't care about what your brain is. First, I'm not about to. If I, bro, everybody go for looks. Fuck. Everybody go for looks. The reason why I got talked to a girl is because she caught her eye. He didn't see her solve a math equation and just go, yeah, I want her right there. She can carry the one. That's the one I want. Nah. He said, one. she got this, she got that. Let me talk to her. And then he may have been like, okay, she's smart too. She can do my taxes. That's what's up. And she's smart. It's always, she cute and she's smart. Not, oh, she's smart. And she cute. Yeah. And she cute. Nah. Nope. Going with the looks. You're shallow. I mean, ain't nobody about to say that yeah, no. what y'all go for? See, women, y'all might be a little different though. So y'all go, y'all go by what he looks like because y'all gonna look at his shoes. Uh, no, and I'm he's barefooted in his no, winter time. No, I know. What I'm talking about. A guy can over time become attractive. That's over time, like the more I like you, the more attractive you may be. The more. <laughs> Nah, like that's why that's why your foot. That motherfucker really ain't that ugly for real. Like you turn your head a little bit to the side, like mm -hmm. he ain't ugly. He for ain't real. even that ugly for real. Man, <laughs> that's why. That's but bad compared mm. to the shit you just said. Oh yeah, 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 man, yeah, yeah, that's crazy. What's your definition of evil? That's an definition of evil. People that do bad mean things to me. That's evil. The opposite of good. What's your definition of evil? Somebody who go out their way to try to hurt you on purpose. Okay, that's you try that's to cause right. harm. Yeah, on purpose. Yeah, on purpose. Yeah, yeah. I say okay. that's evil. Yeah. You trying to? You trying to? Because yeah. I look at people like, and here we learn again. People like Mac Neo ain't really a villain to me. I don't think most people are villains. I think Joker is a villain, but outside of that, I don't think really like. Thanos is definitely a villain. You think? He killed half the race just so he can try to save the race. First of all, we didn't ask you. <laughs> That's number one. We didn't ask you. But is he really a villain? Like He's a villain. You I can't mean, kill everybody and say, hey, I'm saving y'all, though. Yeah, I'm trying I'm to. I'm going to shoot y'all because there's a tornado outside. So yeah. I'm right. saving you. And it's, a, it's a business time for that. It's, um, what? No, it's a real thing. It's like euthanizing someone. Like, it's a real mm. time for that. Yeah, that's deep. Like, but, no, nah, he's a villain. I don't be thinking people be villains. I really don't. You know who else the villain? The original Black Panther. The dad of T'Challa. Yeah, uh, T'Challa. Yeah, T'Chaka is a villain because of what he did to that boy on purpose. He left him there and let him believe that he wasn't one of them. And he killed his father and uh -huh. just left him. Yeah. Like, let him grow up on his own. That's why he became bad and became how he was, yeah. though. He wasn't going to grow up like that if he would have... Been with his people. Saying? Right. Yeah. Oh. And the reason why they killed him is because T'Chaka was trying to keep Wakanda within themselves. All of their resources, all their land, they tried to keep it all, like, to themselves. They didn't want to help nobody else. They were just only for them, only. And they did that was... Yeah. I don't 
somebody said something about that. Right. Yeah, okay. somebody said, uh, this is true. Trojan Black, forget Trojan Black, they can kick rock. What's it's, it's football. Black? It's a football team. Uh, it's a big thing. It's a whole world. You would be surprised. Do you I believe in let eight-year-olds cuss? Um, so, I have some really rich friends. Mm -hmm. And my rich yeah. friends allow their children to cuss. Yeah, these niggas broke. Um, yeah. So <laughs> they all are. They all are broke. Okay, they barely got a pot piss in going out. Okay, these no, are broke. So, <laughs> so listen, um, in moderation, like if my kid drops something, be like, oh shit, I'm gonna be like, boy, watch your mouth. Mm. Uh, but I'm not gonna like whoop them or anything. I wish I could would say something, but it's crazy because that's funny because my son just, oh my gosh, he's 12. He just did a TikTok, and this is exactly what he said. I, it is, I'm like, he was singing a song. I got an A in math and something, something. I got a B in lunch and a D in your bitch. I'm like, no, he <laughs> did not say that. And he has such a high pitched voice. Yeah. So he sounds like a little girl. Yeah. And when he said that, I'm like, okay, initially it's funny. Yeah. I'm like, no, no. I'll be I tell that to boy. Like, come on. I had to go. And then I went to his phone. He tried to punch little girls and try to get freaky with somebody because yeah. that is him. But then when I asked him about it, like, he don't want to say it. He ain't old enough to tell me yet. Yeah. But you want to say it in private. So when I call you out on it, oh, now you want to play the little kid role. No, no, no. no. You yeah. got to be in somebody's, job. right. <laughs> you got your B in and somebody's, <laughs> okay? Like, so don't be scared to say it now, son. Like, My you know son's like, like little dad's, these hoes ain't loyal. Yeah. But I should have known something because he was like, can we listen to Rod Way? Like, I really want to listen to Rod Way. They love that stuff, man. They, they love that stuff. That's... I'm like, what the fuck? So, I said all of that to say, depending on what you said with this cuss word and where you said it, if you mm -hmm. was outside and he was like, shut up, baby, or a whole ass nigga, something like that, I'm not going to be that upset. But you just like, in front of me, just free ass cussing? No, thank you. I punch mm -hmm. you the throat. See, I don't really cuss though. I, I don't think unless I have to be super duper duper angry, but I don't really cuss. So really? I expect my yeah, I don't think that ninety percent of my vernacular is absurd and obscene. <laughs> <I'm sorry>. like, <laughs> and profane. I just, like I don't try because I'm so used to being at work and like, like a too. Fuck yeah. Yeah, I I've been trying to be professional. I don't be saying I mean I talk slang, I guess. I find myself saying that a lot like bruh. Like, yeah. Even though when I met my manager, he's talking to them, I'm like, bruh, like, you tripping, cuz, like, what? I'm like, nigga, you tripping. Like, oh, my bad, Mr. Uh, what's your name? <laughs> but, uh, but, yeah, I don't cuss, but these kids, they be cussing. Bro. I wonder how long it's been like that. Oh, I don't know. I don't, you know, saying you rocking over here. But thinking it's a problem podcast, trap therapy, I don't know. I feel like it's a trap. Why'd you come up with the trap name? What does that mean, trap therapy? Oh, that's a beautiful question. No one's actually ever really asked See? that question. See? Boom. See that? <laughs> Let you hear it first. Um, I asked the best question. So when I think of trap, I think of... Selling drugs. No. That's what I that, Because that, I don't be selling no drugs. I don't even do drugs. No. I'm just hustling. Um, I'm just hustling. <laughs> I am. Look at where I am. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, oh, I'm yeah, hustling. Corporate America life. Ooh, this is corporate America. <laughs> this is above that. I identify as vaccinated. Um, Whoa. Oh, just identify. That's it. Identify. I identify as vaccinated. That's yeah. what we're going to be saying now? Yeah. Dang. I've been hearing, like, um, some girl said I go by they and she. Like, That's her pronoun. I'm like, what are you talking about? I know who you are. Like, what? <laughs> what does that mean? You are her. Talking about some, I go by them, they, or I'm like, what? Okay, so, so when I say your name, I'm like, okay, Lene, them. Yeah, like, you can't what? say she. So Lene is clearly um, probably bisexual or fully gay. Yeah, I think she's fine. Yeah, clearly. And she don't want a label, so you have to call her. So I told you I'm crisis and adventure by, <laughs> by nature. And I had this class. I really passed this class. I got a certificate for it. Mm -hmm. And you better respect that. She probably paid for a few teams, and she mm -hmm. don't want her team to be identified. Mm. And you have to say, and you have to respect the they and thems. Yeah, you know so instead of saying, she crazy, you got to be like, they crazy. Even though we're talking about one person. 
whoa. Yeah, and my little cousin, like my little cousin, oh my gosh, she's like 10, 12 years younger than me. So she's only like 18, 19 now. Little Mimi, well, I know her as Melinda. So, okay, Little Mimi was a girl, girly girl, all the way up until high school, started playing basketball. She has a beauty now. And her is a him, and we got to call her Tommy. Yeah. And I'm like, know. Mimi. No, She's that's like, offensive. No. And she, she will cry out of fit. She will yeah. want to fight you, shoot you. I'm like, that's offensive. This is, come on. It's offensive. I'm like, I'm like, Melinda. No. It's like, she just be her looking around. Tommy like, we'd be messing, joking around with it because we family. But anybody else? Yeah, she a lot of killer. And it's not <laughs> she, it's he. Yeah, like Tommy, he like for real. Ain't no none of that. And she has a beard now. It's not she, he, fucker. He, he has a beard. He, he has a beard. He has a beard. He has a it's finished. Right. <laughs> he, he got a beard. <laughs> right. That's exactly what she got. That's exactly what it is. That is that, that's strange, man. Another question or two, if you don't mind. Then we're going to wrap this up because my phone. Word. Honestly, about, did you? Really? Oh, oh, I'm sorry. We can't show our affiliation. We're thinking it's the problem podcast here in corporate America. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> he wanted to be bougie so bad. You know what I hate? I hate when you got to come to work and people always say good morning to you as soon as you walk in. I don't like talking to people until like three good hours morning. later. Like, hey. Oh, my God. And I call everybody by their name. Good morning, Ooh. James. How are you? Oh, it bothers me. So does much. it? It does. So I'm like, look here, I ain't here yet, bro. You ain't seen me. Don't be telling people I'm here. I don't like when, because I come late every day, so I don't want you. To, Good morning, James. Hey, don't be telling everybody I'm here late again. Like, yeah. come on, now. Like, yeah, I'm messing up the spot. Don't talk you to me at 12 30. Oh. No, I, I really, that's me, but I'm also like, you manager here, so Yes, you top dog. Yeah, yeah, you top dog. I'm not top dog, though. I don't think there is a top dog here. I think we're... It's only three fucking employees here. <laughs> but y'all ain't on the same level, though. Like, you above. We're all on the same level. Like, you got the keys. They do, too. Oh. Uh, um, actually, the maintenance man, I guess, would be top dog. Because he got a key that I don't got. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. He better than you, then. Yeah. You got to set the game up. No. We need to get that extra key. No. What's that extra key open? Um, McCormick is downstairs. You know the seasoning people McCormick are Larry's. Yeah, you know I know Larry. I call it Larry's, but it's yeah. Larry's. Yeah, I thought I thought that was Larry's. I put that on Larry's. Day. And you gotta have season salt. Stop, because that shit. Got and it's so good. How come the stuff that tastes good ain't good for you? Ain't it not? So vagina sometimes it tastes good, sometimes it don't. So. Mm-hmm. And when they don't, it probably ain't no good for you. When they do. I remember mean, this one girl was dying, that smelled like kiwi. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like but maybe she eats a lot of kiwis. That's probably pretty good healthy vagina. I don't know. Mm-hmm. When they smell like pennies, as you stated before. Yeah. No. Or coffee. Yeah. Um, I'm going to say that was good. Nah, that wasn't good. Yeah. Her so, I mean, great. Seeing her later tonight. So, <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what she's doing now. Uh, when do you feel accomplished? Mmm, that's a good one. Cause me, I'm always like on to the next project, on the go. Always like, I got the okay, I did this, I got to top this. I got mm-hmm. this. Like mm-hmm. I'm always trying to find something to do. I'm always staying busy, so I don't never feel accomplished. Like I never sat back and watched a piece of work and was like, yeah, I did. Yeah. I always sit back and go, ugh, could have did that better. Got to tweak this. I got to do, do that. something else. Yeah. I got to do something else to it. Like. I gotta, okay, on this one, I'm gonna do this, 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 and this. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, even on all the films I did, like, I watch it and, like, I cringe because I'm like, Ooh. Yeah. People, okay, but the people watching it, they be like, this is what's great. wrong? Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Like, I'm like, Ooh. Yeah, I can't do that thing. I messed up. Like, I think you, know, you should take the time to smell your own flowers. Yeah, you got to. Because you know you're awesome. Yeah. You said that super time, so. I am awesome, but I be feeling like, man, I never sit back. Awesome and unaccomplished. Yeah. That's why you can't do that. Mm-hmm. Um, I like to end my show all the time with be kind to yourself. 
someone to tell you. Be kind to myself. Be kind to yourself. And I think we can end it there, actually. So thank you for tuning in to the motherfucking greatest. To the track. Thank you for tuning in to the track therapy. This is Dr. Nigga, I'm not going to track. What the fuck they mean? It's me. Okay, now she's... <laughs> Okay. Yeah, this is your boy J City Five One Three. Uh, thinking it's a problem podcast. You know what I'm saying? Uh, where are they gonna find this at? Uh, it'll be on YouTube when you teach me how to edit. <laughs> <laughs> um, cause you're supposed to oh teach me how to send the program skills. I don't know what it is about me, but <clears throat> I always have to teach somebody something. Teach me how to nugget. If you can't teach me anything, we will not be friends. Yeah. And I, I, I need to be able to be like. I think I teach people like in computer stuff. I, yeah. I gotta be like, nah, because my one man could hear, be able to, if I can't do that for you. Because if you hear somebody who like, I need some space, or I, you gonna obviously be like, nah, because my one nigga down here got some little shit, go holla at her and tell her I sent you. Right, yeah. yeah. So if we can't do that for each other, it's not gonna work for me at all. Just said it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. This, this is stupid. All right, guys. Bye, yeah, guys. peace, punch, Captain Crunch. Yeah, Bye, so uh, it's been real in the field. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to myself. I have to do that. Be kind. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be kind to myself. myself. That's what's up. But we here. We here in this thing. What's going on? So people. Okay. I just hold oh, it. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Oh, uh, Fupas. See, Fupas are very cute. I like Fupas. They're not. They're not. You don't like Fupas? Fupas? Fupas. Fatter of a coochie hair. Oh, yeah. I found that. I thought that was actually like the vagina, but it's actually like your stomach. It's my fault. I put it up. That's what it is. Bro, this stuff is fancy, bro. This look like something to shoot love and hip hop in. This look like the scene where they are just like randomly placed. <laughs> Randomly placed a bottle of water just to throw it up somewhere. <laughs> it's like, love hip hop, they be like, hey, I wanted to meet with her because we wasn't get along, so I invited her to lunch. Like, why? And here's me at lunch. Right, yeah, that's what they do. They do that. Like, that's stupid. Like, I, don't I don't know why I keep doing that dance. Y'all know I ain't got TikTok, and I really don't want to do that. Yeah, I can't get with the TikTok. Yeah, I try, I got some funny TikToks, but I can't. I'm a little too low for ticking the tops. For ticking the tops.